what is up everybody welcome back to the server as you can see there's been a lot of craziness added to it since you've last been here with me i have a lot of footage i just haven't released and just haven't been in the mood to edit and i'm figuring i'll just knock it out now so it's gonna be another longer video i guess we'll go ahead and start off with the tour um and then we'll go, go back to through my footage i've got kind of showing partially how some of this house behind me was built paired with um just kind of the antics i've been up to on the server Basically, to get to my house, you follow this path through the woods that start near Josh's house. Uh, my younger, my brother, who owns the server. You follow the thing, you get to this tunnel, and then you get the nice little reveal of my mansion. It's kind of dope. I absolutely adore this place. I put a lot of love and effort into it. If you remember correctly, this is a survival world, but we totally cheat like nobody's business. So call it creative if you want, but we can still get to achievements. So take it with a grain of salt. But I would say about 80 of this, 80% of this place is legit, and 20% was um, creative mode added in. The stuff that was added in via creative mode was about the last 10% of the nether uh, brick blocks that I didn't quite have enough, and a lot of the uh, some of the black and the black stone was creative moded in ever after I ran out. I got I think I got the roof done. Uh, Pure survival wise and then I ran out for this bit here and a little more so my brother just spawned a crap ton in however he did not spawn me in basalt I had to go get that stuff myself and I just have a quite a crap ton of it now so in creative mode he gave me an end portal as per my request and he chopped off the edge at, at per my instructions to make it a 2 by 2 instead of a 3 by 3 to fit with my aesthetic and I got this warped centerpiece to kind of go with it Additionally, you'll hear bats here because I do indeed have bat spawners on the edge just because I like bats and they add the, the creepy mansion feel. Um, I stumbled across this on my own. Uh, I ended up making my own Doom Guy um, banner. It, I, to me, it looks like the Marauder from the Doom Eternal game and that's kind of what I was going for once I accidentally stumbled upon it. And I think it just absolutely fits perfectly with my nether vibe I got going on. So we come on in. Got the crimson doors, new blocks, and underneath we got good old glowstone just to light everything up but it's using all the tricks in the book that I've seen online as well as just picked up on my own you get the armor stands you get the banners hanging from the ceiling trick got a lot of cool little stuff using nice accent pieces from the nether just to give everything this nice dark creepy feel um, you can't see but these buggers you remember the command room my brother has it's gotten expanded since then, and these are actually wither potions in there. So, I'm gonna go ahead and grab one just so you can see. Potions decay, decay, wither too. Not bad boy in there, but it's very handy. You can see my inventory is full of banners at the moment. I'll explain that in a minute. I'm gonna finish the tour. So basically, you got the grand entrance way. We got a nice little crop into the center tower that's just for aesthetic. You got a nice chandelier using the moose. Uh, the shroom light, sorry. Paired with the new chain blocks, the new crimson vine, uh, weeping vines paired with the old nether wart block. You got a lot, of, just a ton of the new pieces all being implemented in different ways. Some of them were ideas from other people and a lot of this is just my own ideas. Get a nice brewing area that you just saw with the potion brewing. You got the cooking area with a little bit of cake that my girlfriend keeps eating because she thinks it's hilarious and it is, it's fine. Got a little accent of wither flowers paired with wither skeleton skulls. Wither skeleton skulls everywhere. Then my youngest brother showed me that you can name color things differently using this symbol. So you do this and type a letter after that. You can type in whatever color you want. But I personally prefer sorry, the C for the nether. Because it makes this absolutely perfect coloration for another, and I try to associate with each realm of what color it is. Overall, I just did blue because I wasn't really, you know, you get it. Everything is nice and organized. This is duplicated blackstone my brother got me. Duplicated slash creative mode. This is my excess nether brick I barely used. And whatnot. I've used a lot more since then because I've made other things that are nether brick, but housewise, you got a pretty simple bedroom pretty proud of it um in this wing you've heard the things creeping around you got a stray in there for my torture chamber 
you got the best use of dinner bone I've ever seen. That's the dinner boned um, guy on a chain line being tortured. I'm waterboarding him, I guess technically is what it is. And I went ahead and made a little cage so I had a villager in here in jail, if you will. Also, I'm over a cave, so I do get cave sounds on occasion. That's what that is. And I'm totally okay with it. It fits the vibe. But I wanted him because I needed the name tags for, from him, so I name tagged everything crazy. Name tags. I named him Dr. Jekyll because I originally saved him from being a zombie villager. And I thought it was funny. Um, one other thing. While I'm here, I did legitimately f uh, I did so much nether exploring that I don't think I recorded. And I actually found pig step legitimately before we started using creative mode. So I was super proud on that. And then from the creative mode, I made a, a mob farm to where I could just farm creeper discs indefinitely, which it's currently not working because my girlfriend blew it up and I believe I have the footage of that. Potentially, we'll see. But yeah, really proud of it. Super dope. Love it to death. I'm not quite sure where I'm gonna put these. I guess I'll put them in his interior castle wall. I'll start placing those bad boys everywhere. We'll go in order of when they were made. So we got first up, we got a lovely little mountain. This was done via a tutorial. Same with the Pokeball. Same with the Herobrine. Pretty much all these are done with, via tutorials online. You can just find them. Just go Google banner ideas and they'll find them. Saber and I don't know, chocolate bar. There, cool. So you can come check all those bad boys out. We'll see how he likes them. They're all pretty fun, they're all a little crazy. Starting to prep for Halloween at the main village. I don't remember how much I showed this originally, but I don't think it was Halloween set up yet, let alone finished. But I added an, added an outer wall and I also added. I think I, I don't think these were complete back in the day. They might have been. I don't remember. But they've been since completed to where all the villagers come to their own job sites during the day in an open air mar market so you can come interact with whoever you need. And I've been adding a lot of Halloween decorations for sake of decoration for Halloween. You know, just usual. My girlfriend's been breeding my horse Dart with a lot of other horses she has found trying to get a really nice crossbreed. And both patternization and speed and darts probably the fastest horse we've found to date. But also with that, we added a uh, another end portal here, a little more traditional, just a little bit spiced up for sake of fun. If you remember this lovely hidden place, it has been expanded, and I've done the coloration change to the existing ones we've already seen. They all still work. I still pure survival. I still can just do whatever I want. So you can just read them on the sides as I pass them what they are. They're nice and slow so you can kind of read them and pause it if you're really that interested. If not, no worries. But yeah, so we're a little overpowered in this world. So you get, you want your good old god apples, boom, god apples. You want another set? Boom, that's fine. Second set of god apples. You want your stinking totem of undying? There it is. Boom. You want some arrows? Boom, arrows. You want a wither potion, boom, wither potion. So on and so forth. You get the idea, it's a lot of fun, it's stupid overpowered, and we have a lot of fun with it. But yeah, I guess on with the moments and montage. I hope you all enjoy. Have a good day. I was trying pointless. to give it to other people, but it, it wasn't working. That'd be pointless. That's just, all right, I'm yeah. here. It's ready. Yeah, okay, I'm, I'm ready. going to destroy the clan blocks later, so. All right. You're gonna destroy all of them? Well, 
This one? Not the vaulted one. one. Just spawned. Okay, you ready, brother? Okay. Beat set. Whee! Come back. What? Okay. <laughs> I can't control it. I bet you I can control it. This, like a little tap. <laughs> I'm trying to keep the sheep in frame so you can tell that I'm not fast forwarding the video at all. <laughs> oh goodness, the game's lagging. You're lagging. No, I'm just uh, 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 uh. I like how Bormus is casually mining. There With my, go. uh. I need a yeah, flat right area. Shovel. Oh, good. Oh, wait. <gasps> Elytra! How fast am I flying? You're gonna be as fast as a Riptide thing, you're just gonna keep hitting the edge of Render. Cause that's what I do when I Riptide, I just keep hitting the Render edge. No, it's not doing anything. That's bull. Ready? Yep. One. <laughs> you see you disappear and Bormas just popping. Uh, I'm just gonna Coming wait. Down. I'm just gonna wait till you come back down. 400. 300, 200, 100. Yeah! Ow. <laughs> <laughs> I just watched you. <laughs> you pop. <laughs> oh. I tried to save it. Oh, that, I got everything. That's going in the video. I'm not sorry about it. I'm going back to my project. The more and more I think about it. Man, my mansion's looking tight. I'm liking this. Now I just gotta add some windows to it because it's just kind of flat still, but it's looking sharp. Okay, so I got that there. I have to fix my inventory. Give me a second. I don't. I do. That, that, that. There. Man blocks. I'm just gonna put those there for now. I'll delete them. Ooh, that'd be. I got a cool idea. Hey Josh, look how fast I can go. Watch. <laughs> you can walk normal Whee! speed as Josh is I'm, stuck. I can normal sprint. <laughs> Ooh, I have to like spam the sprint. I can lay on that torch now. <laughs> Get to sleep next to me, Texas. Oh boy. Oh, there's one down there. I didn't see. Yeah, if we're just gonna have to come in from the back, I don't care. We'll just make it a little better by going around this way. Once I get my house all under control, I'm gonna start on my farm and Texas, my Texas, I found one animals. of your old creeper holes. Oh, you did? Yeah, it's in the woods <laughs> here. Welcome to Mikasa. Holy nether Batman. Jeez. This is awesome. I told you. That, that puts my house to fucking shame. Big time. You know, it was like originally I was going to make this house taller, but by the time I remembered I was going to do that, I already had the roof halfway done, and I didn't feel like going back around and doing all that shit again. Seen a lot of blocks you're not familiar with? Yeah, I'd have to say like 90% of this. I don't know what it is. I mean, it's a lot glowstone. Most, this not glowstone. <laughs> oh, okay. Then I don't know what anything is here. Let me, let me drop you down some glowstone. That is shroom light. I thought maybe they changed the texture or something. Nope. That is shroom light. Actually, my glowstone. Can be, I can make some over here real quick. <sighs> Glowstone. Glowstone. Same as saying? Same as saying? Right here. <laughs> they are different. different. I don't think I can convert this back down, can I? Oh well. Hang on, dude. 
Go to bed, damn. I'm coming. <laughs> I've been wondering what this thing is hovering above my head for the past minute now. Do, you, do I need to take the redstone torch off, bud? No, you're, you're good. Okay. You can take off or put on if you want. It's not going to affect anything. Alright. Hmm. All right, time to get to work. Pardon me. I mean, I don't have collision. I'm just thinking. How on earth am I going to do that? I know. I know that I'm doing trying. <laughs> Are we bed. all sleeping? What the fuck? I went to sleep in my bed and it kicked me out of my bed and destroyed it. What the fuck? Place it right next to me, though. Okay, I'm gonna go fucking protect my turtle egg. There we go. Yep, it's okay. working for Texas now. That was weird. What? It, it made like the mining sound and destroyed it. Zarin, you asshole. <laughs> you wonder why your bed was having trouble? <laughs> oh, you fucker. <laughs>
<laughs> I looked behind me and I saw the little uh, the twirlies from the invisible potion. You fucker. <laughs> Laugh it up, <laughs> asshole. <sighs> I'm totally doing that to Zach too. Okay, there's that. What are you laughing about over there, Mikey? Oh, uh, nothing. You'll appreciate this. Oh boy. I gotta build it first. Oh boy. Yeah, if Mikey starts laughing, that means he's got something brewing. I should probably make the gate a bit wider so I can actually get out with my horse if I need to. <laughs> oh no. I'm concerned all of a sudden. I am as well. You know what your laugh reminds me of? Mikey. Hmm. You know what you Dick Dastardly dog. Yeah, Dick Dastardly dog Muttley. I instantly got Muttley vibes off of that laugh. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go build another crit. Oh, fuck oh. off, Aaron! <laughs> Did you have that oh. mini heart attack I was looking for? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you oh. do? <laughs> oh. I almost died inside. <laughs> What'd you do? I almost <sighs> died inside. Oh man. Oh my gosh. It was perfect. I'm gonna come to you guys' houses and show you. Well, hi there. <laughs> That's all I saw in my window. Was a creeper head. In my window, looking out at me, in my yard was a creeper head. I just died from the side when I saw that. That's funny. <laughs> okay, that's pretty funny. Uh, I was like, no way. I totally have one of these. I forgot I had them. That's, that's hilarious. <laughs> uh. Oh, everything hurts. <laughs> I was like, I was half tempted to be like, hey, uh, could you go forge me something? But I was like, that's going to be suspicious. It's like, I got a window here. Yeah, because you, have, do you this. have everything you need. Let's do this. Let's just do the window. <laughs> it's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Our source block. There you go. Boink. Ow. You take that for me. Done. Oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh,
Those are always. Oh my word! I see what you started. Where are you at? I'm near it. There's a water pool I'm trying to fix. Um, away from the Doom Crucible. Sword. You're behind it, aren't you? I'm closer to the chicken statue. I see you over there. Right next to you. Oh, this is your... We're gonna call it a quarry until it's done. The thing is, once we got it all burrowed out, then we're gonna shape it to how we want it and make it look nice. But until then, it's just gonna be crazy. You're going all the way to Bedrock? Yeah. We only got 50 blocks down to go. I meet you down there. Oh, you wanna do a, a burrow line? Huh, I found a cave. Looks like an unexplored cave. Ooh, big ol'. Find the hole that I went in. I oh, somebody's been down here. There's torches way down here. the kill system. <laughs> Alright. Oh, I messed it. Oh, I did it again. I can't do it again. I keep doing this. But I'm just going to use sand to represent where we want our walls. So I'm thinking we have a center quarter. Each route. That'll encourage them to run in. I'll take a stack if you have an extra stack. I'm actually thinking about keeping it like that on the sides. Okay. Because we'll be able to see in there easier, won't we? Yeah. It's fine. We just can't do it on this wall, can we? And come on up and take a peek, see what you think. It looks pretty visual. You can definitely see where everything is. And it looks like it's bright enough, too. But also, at the same time, it looks like it might be dark enough. <clears throat> Are you down there? Yeah, Are you up here? Where it's going to be down here. You got to come in. We're just okay. going to use this existing spawner, and we can swap the monster out after the fact. But for now, it's going to be a cat spawner, then it'll be a creeper spawner later. I don't even know where it went. Where'd he go? I said I was going to wall it in. Uh, it's right here. Oh, I just... Holy crap, where'd he go?
There he goes. And that's it. See what I mean? Just Okay, I gotta go take a peek. This is just stupidity. Three cats, three cats. Three cats. Alright, here's the moment of truth. You ready? I gotta do a lap. Um, so um, wait, 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 wait. You gotta fix the cat. You gotta fix the cat. Which cat? Right here, right here. Right underneath me. Oh, where's he at? Is he just extra? Maybe. I can find where he needs to go. Might be extra. I'll take him. Because I don't have any cats at my house anymore. You still. Are you just pushing him? I'm just gonna push him out, yeah. I'm coming. All you gotta do is unsit him and then just run him a little ways and he'll teleport to you. Actually, let me pick a cat that I want to take out with me. Oh, he's fine. I'll just take him. Come on, cat. You're the lucky one. You don't have to play with the creepers all the time. So I don't. Do much. Oh, there's one. He's chasing you. Oh, there's one in that one now, too. There's one in that one now, too. Is it working exactly as planned? Oh, he spawned underneath it. That's weird. So they're kind of just in a panic, it looks like. Up, oh, up, oh, almost, almost. Okay, so they, they don't really aggro to the center. They don't have time to realize where they need to run. They're definitely in a panic, though. Hmm. I almost like Up. it just as a torture thing. There you go. Here's one going to the center. Do they realize that's a danger block? Like, do they know they're not supposed to step on that? Because you know they used to be able to. Well, I want to stand right next to the cat. Does this not work anymore? I'm gonna be really sad if it doesn't work anymore. Cause I know it used to work. Hmm. So sound. That's them dying. They're suffocating because they spawned inside the block. They don't look scary. They look like they're all sad faced now. <laughs> They're like, no! Is it Al? I see the, the magic flying sword. Glass that up, or are you coming out again the same way? Ah, they walk on it now. They just ah, I, Whoa. I was hoping I wouldn't do that. 
happened. Oh crap, I'm in here. I'm sorry. I'll fix it. Oh no, not my kitties! Hmm. Oh, my cats are. What the heck? They all got hurts. So they're moving. They're all. Well, you got a crap ton of cats out of here now. <laughs> I'm so agitated. Got a thousand cats chasing me. Wait a second. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. You're immune to creepers now, I can tell you that. Oh my word, you see this? Look at this. It's just like. <laughs> oh, I'm so irritated. I can't. Oh, that's so funny though. Oh, that's frustrating, but oh my gosh, that is so funny. That is still worth it. <laughs> uh, you got a pickaxe I can have? Uh, yeah. I just need to borrow it for a second. Or you need a silk touch. I don't care. Okay, cats, come on. Come on. Okay, I'm gonna make more sand because... Not sand, but boss. Oh, that was funny. Oh, that's... oh I never drank that Mountain Dew from earlier. Oh. <laughs> okay, I'm go. I made one stupid mistake. What'd you do? I smacked one of the creepers because I thought he was too close to me, and I thought he'd detect me. But he had higher health than I thought he would, so he ended up aggroing. And just blowing up. Doing exactly what I was trying not to let him do. Alright, this is your pickaxe. Alright, we gotta do the redstone again. We gotta put all the cats back. I don't know how close I have to be for render. Oh, that was fun. Not cat proof. Yep, you're gonna lose cat. Alright. Well, the creeper farm got finished, and even though it's not meant to be efficient, it's definitely doing its job of tormenting the buggers to get a little bit of revenge on them. Uh, everything worked out in the end. Really happy with the server so far. We're going to keep playing it like crazy and build all sorts of other crazy stuff. But I hope you all enjoyed the video. Sorry it was longer than all my other videos, but I shall catch you all in the next one. See ya.